Hi, I'm Congressman Dennis Kucinich. If you have not been following the recent problems at the Davis-Bessey nuclear power plant in northern Ohio, you should. First Energy operates the plant and wants us to believe that the cracks found in the wall of the Davis-Bessey shield building do not have any structural significance and are merely hairline or barely visible cracks in architectural or decorative features or elements of the building. That's what First Energy told us on October 11, 2011. That's what they told investors on October 31st, 2011. And that's what they told their shareholders in an annual report on February 28, 2012. But the truth is that the davis Bessey Shield Building no longer provides the margin of safety that was required by the Nuclear Regulatory Commission to obtain its license to operate. First Energy admitted this in a report it submitted to the NRC on February 27th. First Energy admitted that the cracks in the shield building wall made the shield building, quote, non-conforming to the current design and licensing bases. In layman terms, that means that given the current condition of the shield building wall, First Energy would not be issued a license to operate Davis-Bessey if it applied for one today. When Davis-Bessey was originally designed, engineers calculated the maximum forces that the shield building would have to withstand. The NRC then required a greater strength to provide a margin of safety. The shield building was constructed with even greater strength than that, providing an additional margin of safety. First Energy's report to the NRC means that the additional margin of safety no longer exists. Translation, the overall margin of safety has been reduced below what the Davis-Bessey operating license required. Davis-Bessey's current license to operate runs through 2017. First Energy wants to extend the license for 20 more years after that, despite the reduced margin of safety of the shield building wall. First Energy must not be granted an extension unless the full margin of safety is restored. We simply cannot take any chances with a nuclear power plant which threatens the safety of the Great Lakes region.